Welcome to this uh, video about my uh, home built pre selector unit equipped with some tunable filters and some band pass filters. Can be used with any kind of radio, but is in this case specially designed to accommodate my SDR reception with the aid of a TV stick, a DVBR stick that's really cheap available anywhere you can buy this for uh, 25 euros or so and also you can download the free software on internet to use the stick to receive um, AM, FM and SSB the software I use is called Sharp the DVB stick is equipped with uh, a tuner called RT820 Tango and is usable from 17 megahertz until 1.5 gigahertz so if you want to use it for shortwave uh, obviously you need a, a converter I designed and built my own one that converts 0 to 100 megahertz to the band of 120 to 220 megahertz The stick is very sensitive, um, there's only one disadvantage and that's the receiving window is very limited. The stick is very easily overloaded and will produce cross modulation and intermodulation. A solution then is obviously um, the use of pre-selection to filter out the frequencies that you want to use. So let's have a quick view inside the converter. In the front end, uh, a low pass filter, 0 to 100 megahertz, is feeding the, uh, the mixer, SBL1. Output from that is going to the output stage, output filter, 120 to 220 megahertz is going to the stick. Down there we have uh, the crystal oscillator. I used a uh, 10 megahertz crystal that was available left to it uh, the multipliers and left to it the last doubler and the output stage from 120 megahertz is producing 120 dB microvolt again the uh, output stage is, uh, is very sharp it's cleaning up every unwanted signal well below 55 dB. Right, um, I'll just see if there's anyone else around. We'll get back to running you, you down, John. Anyone else around for now? With einem allgemeinen Anruf, CQ40, CQ, Dora Ludwig 5, Willi Peter, CQ40, hallo, CQ, CQ, CQ40, Mederwand, ES Delta Lima 5, Whiskey Papa, Dora Ludwig 5, Willi Peter, CQ. And with spectrum analyzer and uh, tracking generator, a nice view on the uh, tunable filters. Um, on the back you can see the switch, the band switch between the several tunable filters. The toroid, the ferrite toroid, and uh, a space for the band pass filters, not already built uh, right now. Um, the capacitor tunable capacitor in two stages and on the other side uh, some space a power supply and uh, 
the SDR stick that is in use and on the bottom an attenuator CQ amplifier. Here you can see the, uh, the band test filters, the tunable filters and the bandwidth of those filters is very narrow indeed. To accomplish this, the input and the output of the ferrite rings, the steroids, um, is just one winding and the coupling between the two steroids, the two um, ferrite rings, is only a piece of coax. If you look at this, you can't believe that the uh, losses in this circuitry are at maximum 4 to 5 dB. So this is the end of the video about my uh, pre-selector project um, and the converter, the HF converter. The free available software from Sharp is working very very well and stable under XP and Windows 7. It can handle all kinds of uh, modulation modes and the zoom function is working very very well. But there's a little drawback. In some rare cases um, the zoom function will disappear from your computer screen. And there's a very way, very simple way to alter that and that is don't make the picture full size. Leave it just a few percent smaller than your computer screen and the zoom function will stay on. Thank you for watching and I hope it will inspire you to build your own unit. Bye bye.